I mean, from uh, uh, 1.30 to 3.30. Today is 1.30 to 3.30, right? Yes, sir. Next Sunday, it'll be what? 2 to 3. 2 to 3. Assistant yes. Secretary will uh, give you that information. Mm -hmm. uh, but at this time, we're going to close. And uh, I turned the meeting back over to my assistant minister, Mr. Yusuf Muhammad, as I greet you. Peace in paradise. Salam alaikum. That was wonderful. Yes, sir. I was yes, back there taking down notes. <laughs> <laughs> At this time, does anyone have any questions they would like to ask dealing with Islam or Christianity? Assalamu alaikum. Brother Miss, I have a question. Uh, it's a regarding the situation that's going on out there in Waco. And it's like, okay, now when the blacks get out there and protest and march peaceful, have peaceful demonstrations, the police and the devils want to attack them. But up in Waco, these bikers threaten to retaliate and shoot the police, but then they want to come and try to be peaceful with them. So why is it, you know, the devil, you know, willing to be peaceful with these bikers who are hostile, but be hostile toward the black protesters who are peaceful? Because you're talking about the devil and his brother. Yes, sir. Both of them are killers. Yes, sir. So it's different uh, with the brother, with the devil. Retaliating on the devil. Why do you think they have all those guns and ammunition? It's not to kill black people because black people are not fighters and killers. But they are fighting and killing their own. A lot has said that in this day and time that the minds of the devil will be so corrupt that they will self destruct. And that's what is happening. Mm -hmm. They're bone killers and they can't kill somebody else or find somebody else to kill. They kill it all. Yes, so, sir. And that's what you find happening, brother. Yes, sir. So,